Welcome to MyotherapyHealthcare.com. This is Laura Lee. I'm a nutritional ther therapist, and I'm here to talk about the question of, do you have a pee problem? Do you have a problem with holding your water in? Um, most women consider their toilet habits normal, but let's see if they are or not. Do you go to the toilet four to six times each day? And do you sleep or do you get up only once through the night? Do you have dry pants all the time? Do you pass three to 400 millimeters each time? That's like a coffee mug size. Do you pass water easily without straining or stopping or, st or starting? Do you find urinating is painless and quite a comfortable thing to do? When women's water works break down, they usually complain of three major symptoms. Stress incontinence, the leaks which happen when they cough, sneeze, swing at a golf club, or lunge at te tennis. Urgency, Number two, the real strong need to pass urine, which, if ignored, most women would feel that would cause them to wet their pants. Three, frequency, a self-explanatory term which applies to the need to empty the bladder often, which only a short time between visits to the toilet. If this frequency occurs during the night, it is referred to as nocturia. A combination of any of all these symptoms can be present. And I read those. So if you have any of this or if this rings a bell to you or you can relate, check out Women's Water Works, Curing Incontinence by Dr. Pauline Chirelli. I'm going to go ahead and put that in the description. But this is a book, and this is what's in it. <clears throat> the table of contents. One, introducing Women's Water Works. Two, what we've got and how it works. Three, multifunctional pelvic floor. Four, the rise and the fall of the pelvic floor. Five, not, not only but also. Six, testing, testing. Seven, taking things into your own hands. Eight, getting to the crux of the matter. Nine, pelvic floor exercises, bells and whistles. Ten, special hints for special people. And eleven, prevention is better than a cure. So that's what's in the waterworks here. It's a great booklet. And I'm going to go ahead on the next video, read you part two of the waterworks. Love life and life will love you back. And when you can hold in your water as you need to, it's a good thing. All right, we'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye for now.